Hello and welcome to my review of Rose, the first episode of Doctor Who to air in 2005 to mark the beginning of the revival series. Um, this is a great episode to introduce uh, somebody to new Doctor Who about. Not only does it introduce the new Doctor, it also introduces us to the new companion played by Billy Piper. Her name is Rose, hence the name of the episode. Um, and it introduces the audience to the companion's family. So within Rose's family we have Rose herself, we have Pete who we then learn down the line in concurrent episodes later in the season is his da is her dad. Um, we also are introduced to Jack Jackie Tyler who is Rose's mom um, and we're also introduced to enemies that we haven't seen I think since the 70s or which are Tom Baker and Pertwee's Doctor's Era. Um, they introduce us into a classic uh, monster updated for the revival series um, called the Autons and basically these Autons are controlled by the Nestine Consciences and basically um, the Nestine Consciousness uh, wakes up and causes havoc among the city of uh, London in sh bursting through uh, shop dummy windows um, and basically creating havoc among the civilians there. Um, this was a great episode because not only did it introduce us to all those things it also introduced us to um, stories that can happen outside of Earth and not everything has to be placed on Earth and uh, you know we're introduced to a, a little bit of the Doctor's past as well um, so this incarnation of the Doctor in, revi in the Revived series is an uh, gives us a little bit of history and it's um, in tying in with the story of the Time War and everything and, say, and basically this character the, the, the Doctor is basically a child of the Time War and he basically bottles up his feelings in to suppress how he's actually feeling so that he carries on um, throughout his life not wanting to give a care in the world about anybody um, but then we figure out that he's a little bit lonely and he needs someone to travel with or that's what he thinks so in this instance um, he plays a quip at the end of Rose and basically flies, takes off and then comes back to prove that the TARDIS can move places because it was mentioned earlier in the episode that um, Rose was questioning the doctor about we've moved and we've moved from my housing estate to uh, London just outside the the London um, Ferris wheel so um, this episode covers a lot of ground for new for new fans who are just joining the series and um, I'm sad I didn't keep up with Eccleston's Doctor at the time because um, I was only five years old when Doctor Who uh, returned to the screens so I didn't really have too much of an interest in Doctor Who but then I, as I got older um, you know I managed to get the the I managed to get all of the um, series from series 1 to um, series 13 on DVD and I began watching back his era um, and I think it's one that a lot of fans kind of look down upon um, and I think that needs to change so yeah thank you very much for watching my review of Rose, uh, the first episode in series one of the Revive series. I'll be back the same time next week or whenever I get the chance to review the on the end of the world and uh, we'll continue there. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.